welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I am Hannah and today we are doing a Shein bathing suit haul. Now I went back and forth so many times whether or not I wanted to do this haul because one I'm putting myself out on the internet in a bathing suit and two we just went through a you know quarantine situation so I have gained a little bit of weight but honestly I really wanted to do this because I have a real normal body so I want to do this haul for us normal ladies out there. So if you are interested in that make sure that you guys do watch this video until the end. I will also leave everything linked down below so if you guys want to purchase any of these swimsuits, the sizing will be down there as well. So make sure you guys check that out. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started on the Shein bathing suit haul. Now, if you don't know what Shein is, it is a similar website to things like Zaffle. Everything does come from China, but I ordered this on a Saturday and it was here by Thursday and that was standard shipping. They always have sales So everything is super super inexpensive and then you have even cheaper options with discount codes I did get all of my swimsuits in a size small first swimsuit is this tie-dye blue bikini Now what I love about this bikini is one it does come with adjustable straps I don't know about you But I've done like the sports bra looking swimsuits before in the past and I'm not very gifted in the chest department So having adjustable straps is super nice because it allows for some wiggle room obviously this is definitely not a big bust friendly swimsuit and then on the side you do have a drastic 90 degree angle that does kind of stop and then you have a thin band in the back the top is obviously lined and then it does have a pad in here as well you can take them out if you don't want to have a pad in there it is a little bit on the thin side. It's not the best feeling swimsuit out of all of the suits that I did pick up, but I'm pretty sure it was under $15. The bottoms are very cheeky, but they are also high-waisted, so this is what the bottom looks like. The front of the bottom is lined. The back, however, is not, and the back part, which obviously sits on your booty side, is very, very thin. So, if you don't like that, this may not be for you. The only downside with these swimsuits, however, is that they don't come in, like, mix-match sizes. If you do get a small top, you do have to get a small bottom. It just, it is what it is. That is kind of the downside. I think personally my chest is more of an extra small to a small. My bottom, however, is probably more of a medium. So if you do have a little bit of a bigger booty or a little bit of a bigger chest, just be aware you may need to size up. However, they're cheap enough where if you do have like sewing skills, you definitely could sew them. It just depends on what you want to do and how willing you are to tailor these to fit you. Next swimsuit, which is actually my favorite. Well, not it's not my favorite. It's one of my favorites. It is this asymmetrical cow print bikini. And can we just talk about how freaking cute this is? So you have a cow print on one side. It does come with an adjustable strap on the other side, so you can adjust it to how you need it to fit. The other side does not come with an adjustable strap. This does fit me very, very well. I do think that because they lined it with black, this white almost does come off a little blue compared to like a white white. So in person, just be aware, it does look kind of dirty, but it's still super, super cute. And I cannot wait to wear this or you have a thick band that goes underneath the bust which is very I would say almost heavy duty it's very stretchy but it's also like still pretty tight which I really like and then the bottoms again are this asymmetrical look which I really I just like how freaking cute is this same thing with this bottom you do have a lined front however the back side is not lined but it is black and it's not see-through like you can I can hold this up against my lights. It's you, you can't see through it, which I really like. But now that I think about it, if white gets wet, it does get a little bit translucent. So to me, is that going to affect it? I think for the summer and living in Wisconsin, this is just... Like, I feel like a lot of people are really going to like this. So Shein is where it's at. And again, very affordable fun fun. All right, next swimsuit that I did purchase is a one piece and I am just going to be honest with you, I am not probably going to do any inserts of anything below my waist with this because she is very very high cut. Like very high cut. This is a one piece. It is half leopard and half black. However, in person, yes, it looks like the photo, okay? It does. It looks like the photo. The top is also very small. Like, this barely covers my little, you know, littleness. How is this going to cover somebody with a bigger chest? I don't know. And then I was like, well, maybe I don't have it pulled up high enough, but like, girl, it's already high enough. It's like, my lady bits are hanging. It's just not a good situation. And the pattern is so freaking cute. The style is so cute. You got that deep V. It's... 
Again, a very high cut, a lot of booty showing. So if you're not into that, don't don't purchase this but if you have a smaller booty and a smaller bust this is definitely cute if you want something that's a little bit more f you know I wouldn't even say coverage because it definitely don't cover nothing but it is super cute I like the idea of it this one did also have a bunch of different design patterns so like you can flip flop them for like half and half but again she low cut she high cut on the side and she is very cheeky so I'm be prepared to, it's just a lot. So if you're not ready for that, I'm gonna keep it because I can't return it, so we're gonna keep it. But I don't know how much I'm gonna wear her. And I don't really have anybody in my life that I think I could give that to. It's just, and I, we'll see how it looks with shorts. And then I'll make my final decision, which is probably gonna be I'm only gonna wear it with shorts. Next suit. I got this other tie-dye suit. Now, I have never had a suit that has this underwire situation, but the padding on this is the smallest padding I have ever seen on a suit. It is very, very revealing. Like, enough for my boyfriend to even be like, yeah, maybe you shouldn't wear that out in public. But it is so cute. Like, the idea of this is so cute and I think so flattering for maybe somebody with, a, like, a tinier bust. I think us small bust ladies, like, this is where it's at. It also has a adjustable straps which again I just feel like this is made for like a tween but I also feel like it's way too sexy for a tween I'm very confused by this and I feel like the bottoms fit me good and they're also a small and the tops a small but the top is small the back also comes with a clip I can get this I always I always forget how these go but they're like the metal clippy clap things that go that you're like supposed to like slide through each other like what am I oh there we go so it just like clips together, slides into place, and then locks, which I think is nice because I don't really like tie suits. I feel like tie suits tend to fall off of me. But again, I love this underwire. I love the idea of this, but the coverage is so minimal. It's a little scary where I don't feel like I could wear this anywhere. So for me, I like the idea, but I'm going to pass on this one. And then the bottom... Oh. Have to get the hygienic thing off. Then the bottoms on this one are same thing. Very, very very cheeky. It is at this point that this is almost a thong. The front's cute and again I will insert a clip of me wearing this in the front. I'm gonna pass on this. However, the idea of it is so cute. The execution of it, not so much. I don't feel like this is the right one. Just not the right one. I found the right one. This one ain't it. This suit I ordered and I was so, so excited for. I was so excited for this suit. The pattern is to die for. However, the bottoms, not so much. Oh my god, can we take a second to talk about how freaking cute this pattern is. It does have padding you can easily take out, I think. Just kidding, on this one you can't take the padding out. Um, on the last one you could. Almost all of them, I guess, besides this one, you can take the padding out. It does come with a thick strap, and these straps are adjustable. And then, I don't know if I mentioned this, but on all the other swimsuits, the clasps on them are actually metal, which I think is really, really nice. This feels luxurious. Like, this feels like a good fabric compared to a lot of the other ones. It's made well. I haven't seen any loose strings on any of these. It is lined on the inside. However, the side paneling is not. And then on the bottom, you have the same exact pattern. You have ties on the side. They're so cheeky. If somebody can send me a website try out some suits from that aren't basically thongs, please let me know. I mean, I feel like I shouldn't have to accept that this is the norm in swimsuits. I just feel like that's that's just not it. So if somebody could just like send me something that's like cute, full coverage for like big booties, please let me know. The whole bottom of this swimsuit is completely lined, the back and all, and it is so soft. Last but certainly not least, this is my favorite swimsuit out of all the swimsuits that I bought. It is the most flattering. Ah, it's perfect. Hold on. Let me show you. This is a strapless hot pink swimsuit with this tiny white daisy print. This is the nicest quality. It has a full lined inside. It has padding in it. You can take out if you don't want padding. That ain't it for you. It's literally perfect. I love this swimsuit. The only downside to this and the only issue that I have with it is that it doesn't come with a strap. So if you don't like strapless swimsuits and you don't wanna like have to pull this up constantly, maybe this isn't for you. The real showstopper to this look is the bottoms, okay? The bottoms are this 
perfectly I wouldn't even say high-waisted they are like a mid-rise where they just hit below the belly button so they kind of keep your tummy a little bit more tucked in so it is a mid-rise with this nice thick band it is super nice like heavy duty like a nice quality swimsuit the whole inside of the swimsuit is fully lined with the exact same pattern and then in the front you also have and I don't know if you guys can see this but you also have this nice seam on both sides is just super flattering the top also doesn't have any boning like I know some strapless swimsuits come with boning this one does not so be prepared for that but it is so nice I think that even though the bottoms are a little bit more cheeky on the back you still do get such a nice like it's just a flattering shape because it's not up too high where you feel like you're like in a 90s bathing suit commercial this was one of the swimsuits that I was like kind of iffy on I don't really know how much I'm actually gonna be wearing this swimsuit but I think out of all of the swimsuits this year and this season, this one is going to be the one that I probably wear to absolute death. This one and the cow one are my absolute favorites. Oops. All right, you guys, so that is it for this Shein bathing suit haul. Make sure you guys comment down below which one your favorite one was, and then if you are interested in purchasing any of these, they will also be listed down below as well. Check them out if you aren't here for pink, blue, or whatever. They come in a million different colors, and they are all super, super affordable. Please don't leave me hate. If you guys think I'm fat, that's fine, but keep it to yourself. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I hope that you guys enjoy my channel. If you guys did like this video, please subscribe. It really helps me out. Comment down below what you guys want to see next, and I will catch you guys in my next video. Mwah. Bye, guys.